Welcome back to Math Window. Solve this equation. x to the power of x to the power of 4 is equal to 64. For dealing with this question, we can do this. Because, since here appears two axes and only one 4, only exponent. So now I'm going to get a fourth power on the both sides. So now, x to the power of x to the power of 4. And then, also power of 4. Get a fourth power on the both sides. 64 to the power of 4. There are two x and two 4. So each x has a 4. Now I'm going to use a formula. That is, a to the power of m, and then bracket all to the power of m is equal to a to the power of m times n. The exponent becomes m then times n, and it is also equal to a to the power of n bracket all to the power of m. The left hand side can be changed into x to the power of now you should pay attention. In the bracket, the exponent is x to the power of 4. We calculate it from top to bottom. So x then to the power of m is x to the power of 4 and n is this 4. So it is m then times n. It is x to the power of x to the power of 4 then times 4. So this is the new exponent. The right hand side is still 64 and then to the power of 4. Use this formula. n is 4. m is x to the power of 4. So it is equal to a to the power of n and then all to the power of m. And a is this x on the bottom. So it is equal to x to the power of 4. And then all to the power of x to the power of 4 is equal to 64, and then all to the power of 4. The base is x to the power of 4, and the exponent is also x to the power of 4. They have the same value. So it becomes the form something to the power of it. Self. Now I have hopeless. I hope the right hand side, 64 to the power of 4, can be also written into the form something to the power of itself. Now, because 64 is a nice number, it is 8 squared. So 64 then to the power of 4, it can be written as 8 squared and then also to the power of 4. So, use this formula. A is 8, M is 2, and N is 4. So, it is equal to A to the power of M then times N. So, it is 8 to the power of the product of 2 and 4. It is equal to. Now, it's enough because 2 times 4 is 8. So it can be written as 8 to the power of 8. Then 8 to the power of 8 is the form something to the power of itself. x to the power of 4. Also power of x to the power of 4 is equal to 8 to the power of 8. This equation, how should we solve? The base and the exponent are same. This base and this exponent is, are also same. So you can get the exponent x to the power of 4, or the base x to the power of 4, from the left hand side is equal to the base or the exponent from the right hand side is 8. x to the power of 4 is equal to 8. This equation, how 
should we solve? Is it easy? Yes. Since 4 is even, so this equation, or this equation, has two real roots. x is equal to positive or negative the fourth root of 8. Do you get it? And don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe my channel for more videos. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.